Hey guy, I got my iPhone 12, which shows 5G, but it is slow like a 3G though. Sometime the 5G icon is not even showing. After a long fix, I finally got my 5G back on track. If your iPhone 5G not working too, specifically after update to iOS 17, no worries. Here we'll provide you with all the information you need to troubleshoot and solve this problem. Let's get started. The first step is to check if both your device and carrier support 5G or not. These iPhone series are all supported with 5G and you can go to settings. Tap on cellular and cellular data options. Look for the option voice and data, then ensure 5G on or 5G auto is selected. If 5G is not available to options, contact your carrier about your cellular plans. Here we can see that these options come with some notes. It shows us that battery settings and the low data mode may infect your 5G connectivity. So we can go back and go to data mode. The low data mode may infect your 5G connectivity. So we can choose always allow more data on 5G here. And same for the low power mode, we can find the battery in settings and turn off low power mode if it was on. Back to cellular part. If you are traveling or using a different region SIM card, make sure your carrier supports data roaming and turn it on that it can avoid 5G not working issue. If you have an iPhone with dual SIM capability, it's important to check your cellular plans and make sure both plans use the same carrier and support 5G connectivity. You can call the carrier to update it. And if you accidentally turn on airplane mode, you can't get 5G for sure, so make sure to turn it off. But I guess you guys would notice that. Then you can test your 5G connection by downloading an app or website to see if the 5G is working well. Normally the internet speed will return to normal, but if all that can't do the trick, here are another six fixes for you to try. You can check the timestamps in the description and jump to the part that suits you. If you think that's a frequently occurring issue, most likely it is a system problem so we can use Reiboot to standard repair it. Fix 1, fix 5G not working with standard repair. Reiboot is the best solution to fix software issues because it can help detect and fix a lot of iPhone issues at the same time without any data loss. Plus, you can save time and avoid the hassle of all the manual trying or spending hundreds of dollars in repair stores. Here is how to use it. Connect your iPhone to the computer. Launch Rei Boot. Simply click on the green start button. Choose standard repair to avoid data loss and follow the on-screen instructions to go through the process. Although it is a paid version, it is worth a try as it could keep all your data and your 5G problem will be fixed. Then you can test your 5G connection. Link in below if you want you try it. You can also use Rei Boot to upgrade or downgrade your iPhone as you need. Especially help with the 5G, not working problem shown after the system update on your phone. If you don't think it's a frequent problem, here are three fixes you can try. First, you can force restart your iPhone. It can refresh your phone and improve its performance. Let's try. Press and release the volume up button, then the volume down button. Then keep pressing the side button until you see the Apple logo, just that simple. Or you can replug your SIM card or log into your eSIM again. It may just be a bad SIM card contact or a slight delay in your network service. Or you can try reset your network settings in general and then choose transfer or reset iPhone. Use this reset network settings to see if this helps. Normally after all these trying, your iPhone's 5G connectivity will be back on track. If all these methods are not working, it may be the hardware or the cellular services problem. So go contact the support team for help, whether it's cellular or Apple support. 
Okay, here are nearly 12 methods for you guys to fix the 5G not working problem. Hope all that will work. Please like and subscribe to support us, or leave a comment with any question. Whether it is related or not, we are always here to help. Stay tuned for our upcoming videos. See you next time.